want to know how to add multiple UV maps to an object without adding extra geometry in Blender, let's do it. First, delete the default cube and add or model your object. This is the antique brass domestic storage jar I got from Blender kit add-on. Next on this jar, we are going to add our Art of View logo on it. So to do that, simply split the viewport into two parts and change the bottom one to the shader editor panel. This is the node setup that's already applied to the model. Now go to the Vertex properties tab, expand the UV map section. I'm also going to add another viewport and switch it to the UV editor panel. Then click on this add icon to create a new UV map and rename it as logo. Next find your logo and simply drag and drop it inside Blender like this. Now place your logo image texture node here like this. Add a mix color node, connect the result output to the base color, connect the color output of the logo texture to color socket B and your previous texture to color socket A. Also connect the alpha output to the factor input of the mix color node. After that drag the vector input of the logo image texture node, search for UV map node and select the logo UV we created earlier. Next select the storage jar, move to edit mode, press A to select all the vertices and in the UV editor move and scale the UV projection according to your preference something like this. You will see multiple projection of the logo on the storage jar. So to fix this repetitive logo, simply go to the image texture node and change the repeat mode to clip and you're done. The issue has been fixed now. Next, I have moved ahead and added another logo on this storage jar using the same method and this is the node setup I have used. I have added another UV map named logo 2 and connected everything like this as you guys can see. And that's it you're done. By using the same method, you can now add multiple UV maps to a single object without adding any extra geometry in Blender. Follow Art for more.